at Dartmouth Hitchcock studying a naturally occurring poison. We're the granite state and part of that granite state is that we have um, natural arsenic that seeps into our groundwater. Data from Dartmouth Hitchcock leading to New Hampshire Governor Chris Sununu signing a bill on Friday, cutting the allowed amount of arsenic in public water in half from 10 parts per billion to five. We're finding health effects at levels at which we previously thought were perhaps safe. Carolyn Murray is studying the effect of different arsenic levels in well water on expectant mothers. About 20 to 25 percent of our um, moms who enrolled in our study did have evidence at that time of enrollment of arsenic in their wells that exceeded even the 10 part per billion level. Technicians receive and sort stool, urine and blood samples before it's sent over to Dartmouth College where they determine arsenic levels. Research here found higher arsenic levels were associated with certain cancers, cardiovascular disease, hypertension, and even hormonal effects. The research dictating statewide policy. This action by um, the New Hampshire Department of Environmental Services and the governor in signing this legislation is a great example of this partnership between good science and good policy and good risk management. To actually bring the work we do in the lab that once some small aspect of it helps change policies. Very rewarding. At Dartmouth Hitchcock, Nathaniel Reed, NBC5 News.